Hello, I'm Cam and welcome to Start Select. Coming up on today's Newsathon. Bad news everyone, planning to vamp it up in Skyrim on PS3, Dongard might not make it to the Sony console. And PAX gets underway in Seattle. Alright, now before we dive head first into the news pool this morning, much like that hit novel slash film, we need to talk about Start Select. As Johnny said yesterday, the show will be on a hiatus next week as we experiment with some new ways of bringing you guys game news in video. So if this makes you feel excited, yeah, outraged, Why I order? jubilant, yeah. mournful, querulous, what? then let us know about it in the comments of all our videos all next week. Your feedback really will be instrumental in helping us decide the future of the way we approach video news at GameSpot, and we really appreciate all of the opinions, even the silly ones. What's more, as we know nobody likes change, we're going to make it up to you. I'm happy to tease for the first time a brand new show which will launch this time next week. The best part? Well, it's all about you. And with Mr. Johnny Chiodini at the helm, damn, you know it's going to be a good one. Phew. Okay, so without any further ado, news time. The Dawn Guard. They think they can stop us. In a statement on new company site Bethsoft, Bethesda laid out the current situation regarding the status of Dawnguard on the PS3. In it, the company stated that Skyrim is a massive and dynamic game that requires a lot of resources and things get much more complex when you're talking about sizable content like Dawnguard. We have tried a number of things, but none of them solve the issue enough to make Dawnguard good for everyone. Dawnguard is obviously not the only DLC we've been working on either, so the issue of adding content gets even more complicated. This is not a problem we're positive we can solve. So the future of Vampire Simulator Dawnguard and future DLC coming to Skyrim on PS3 is looking best case troubled and delayed, and worst case, maybe not even possible. In the same post, Bethesda stressed a continued dialogue on the matter, saying, When we have an update, we will certainly let you know. We deeply appreciate all the time and support you have given us, and we'll keep doing our best to return that. So, PS3 owners, how does this make you feel? Have you given up any hope of ever sinking your teeth into the necks of Skyrim's many denizens? Or are you hopeful that Bethesda will somehow find a way to make it work? Let us know in the comments. And finally, PAX or Penny Arcade Expo begins today in Seattle. So what exactly is PAX? Well, PAX Prime, which is a show underway today, and PAX East, which took place in April in Boston, represent the two largest gaming events in North America. This week at PAX Prime, attendees will find a console free play area with hundreds of gaming stations set up for fans to play, handheld lounge, PC arena, panels, concerts, and more, and of course, game publishers and devs showing off their wares in the exhibit hall. GameSpot has sent its own crack team to cover the show in full, so make sure you keep your eyes glued to the website over the next three days for all the goings on. Not literally though. In fact, I should stress that under no circumstances should you ever adhesively apply your eyes to a computer screen, TV screen, or really any surface. Finding a solvent which dissolves glue without dissolving the human eye is, well, difficult. And that's all we have for Start Select this week. As I said at the top of the show, Start Select will be taking a holiday next week, but we will of course still be around, bringing you guys video news in new and exciting ways. See you then. Really will be instrumental in helping us decide the future. Nah, <laughs> helping us decide the future. Because that is a power we possess. Hey YouTube, thanks for sticking around to the end of Start Select. If you'd like to watch more Start Select, then you can click the lovely box that's just up here. Or if you'd like to subscribe to GameSpot and check out all our shows, then you can click the box up here. I will see you soon.